Hello book nerds who own computers, if I'm a bit quiet it's because my family is still asleep and this is the only time I get some quiet so I can film video. So this is my April book haul, yeah! This month I did get quite a few books, a lot of them were quite cheap because I got them from a library sale they were selling these books at the library and a lot of these books are quite new books so I was surprised when I saw them for sale so I got a few of them for sale and my parents were nice enough to buy some of the others as well there is a lot of books so I might not be able to do a really long description of what the book's about but I will try and do a brief description so, as usual, I'm going to start off with the series that I bought. There's some series here today that I bought. Now, this is one or more book in a in the same series. So, the first series that I got was Wither and Fever? Yeah, Fever by Lauren De Stefano. This is actually a trilogy. The last one in the trilogy is called Sever and I've yet to be able to find it yet and it is the garden the chemical garden trilogy and I'm very excited to start reading these. The next series I got was The Wolf Springs Chronicles by Nancy Holden and Debbie sorry for that and Debbie Vuki and it has three books in the series. There's currently Unleashed there's also Hot Blooded and Savage. The next series I got, I was actually surprised that I found this. I was going to buy them off the internet, but I was actually really surprised when I found this. This is currently, the, there's currently three books out, but I only own two, because I couldn't find the third one. That is Cinder and Scarlet by Marissa Meyer. The next series I got was Slated by Terry Terry. This is currently a trilogy and it starts with Slated, it continues with Fractured and I think it finishes with Shattered. Right, uh, these series are over on a different shelf and I don't really want to bring them over and fumble with putting them back on. So the, so the next series that I got was the House of Night series by PC and Kirsten Cast. Next, if you guys didn't know, I am in two stage productions now. I'm in High School Musical, but I'm also in a stage production of Alice in Wonderland. And because of that, my dad decided to get me the complete works of Lewis Carroll. Next, this series is currently a TV show. And I wanted to see what all the fuss is about, so I was going to start slowly reading the first book while watching the TV show. And that is... A Song of Fire and Ice series by George R. R. Martin, and if you don't know, it's TV show name, it's The Game of Thrones, and I'm currently reading A Game of Thrones, obviously, and I like it, it's quite cool, yeah. Now it's time for singular books. That would mean that they're not currently in the series, or they're a single book all on, on their own, or that they are the sequel to a book that's already out that I already bought a few months ago or last month, a different month. First off, I already got this book but I'm, it, they brought out the movie cover and I had to buy it. It's The Fault in Our Stars by John Green and it's the gorgeous movie cover with Shailene and Enzel. Next up, a few months ago I got the Unbecoming a Maradaya. So this month I got The Evolution of Maradaya, and I'm not 100% sure what this book is about because I do not like to read the synopsis of the second book if I have not read the first book. Next I got a sci-fi book which I don't usually buy but I liked the look of this one. It's called 120, 72 Hours on the Moon. Next I got Scarlet by A.C. Gorgon. And it's basically a retelling of Robin Hood where Will Scarlet is actually a very trained woman. Next I got Even Adam by Michael Grant and Catherine Applegate. Next I got Mila 2.0 by Deborah Dreeser. And I'm not 100% sure what this is about because I was just given it by my friend who she didn't like it but she thought that I might like it. Next up I was actually quite surprised to find this. I wasn't... I've never heard of it, but when I saw it and saw who 
partly wrote it. I was excited. It's called Steampunk and it's a collection of short stories. So this book is Hollow Pike by James Dawson and it's just about witchcraft. That's all I need to say. It is about witchcraft. I got the selection by Kira Cass and everyone seems to be going crazy about this book. Next I was really really surprised to find this in the library sale and I was not expecting it there. But it's The Coldest Girl in Cold Town by Holly Black. Next up, I picked this one up because it mainly had a sticker on it saying if you liked Throne of Glass, then you'll like this. So I like Throne of Glass, so I bought this. It's called True Fire by Gary Meehan. Next, I saw the second book of this in a store, but I, I didn't get it. And I finally found the first book in a charity store and I bought it and it is Wake by Amanda Hocking. Hocking. Next I got this book on, on, on an offer called The Sound by Sarah Alderson. Next I got this book with True Fire and I've already started reading it. It's called Valentine Joe by Rebecca Stevens. Next, I got yet another sci-fi novel. It's called Across the Universe by Beth Revis. Next, I got this book as well. Obviously, I got books called She's Not Invisible by Marcus Sedwick. Next, I got Fever last month, I think. So this month, I got the sequel to it, which is called Delirium. Next, I got this book called Sawbones. Next up, I got Angel Dust by Sarah Moosey. Next up, this is a crime book, this is not a YA book, and it's called No One Left to Tell by Karen Rose. Next, I got Adorkable by Sarah Manning. Next, I got this because it kind of looked like um, Throne of Glass, and it's called The False Prince. Next, I was given this book called Bl The Blood Guard by Cartel Roy. So that was my haul for this month, guys. It definitely won't be this month much next month but I have a book deposit my first ever book depository order coming through very soon I have seven books coming from there so I'll make a video of the unboxing so thank you guys for watching please subscribe don't forget your local library and keep reading bye